Hello and welcome to my little preview for State of Decay Year 1 Survival Edition. That is a long title. <laughs> that is a very long title. So originally this game came out on 360, eventually to PC. So this version of State of Decay is the definitive edition of the game. So this is hopefully the last release of this game. Um, it's, it's a good game, don't get me wrong, but um, I feel like it's been like re-released, re-released again and it's it keeps popping out of nowhere. But this now has upridge textures, better lighting, 1080p gameplay. And generally, to me, it looked a lot better. I played the 360 version quite a bit. Uh, it's a quite a fun game, but it never looked very pretty. Um, and this definitive edition still doesn't look that great. I mean, it still it still looks very average, um, if I'm honest. But it does definitely look like a step forward. The game performs better. You may see some pop-ins still with the train in the background. And sometimes the frames might drop a little bit when there's a lot of zombies and stuff on the screen. But generally, the performance is definitely better uh, than the 360. Um, so also, this includes... A 33% discount if you own the original game. So you get a nice little discount, which is pretty cool. Um, also, if you own the previous version, you get a few exclusive characters. So it's a little bit like a reward from the developers just saying thank you for supporting the game and buying it twice. Also, on a side note, the game will be costing $30 or 30 euros or 20 UK pounds on release, which is on the 28th, no, 28th of April this year. Woo! Also includes some new achievements, a new mission type, which is uh, based on supply crates. The supply crates come down, make a lot of noise, loads of zombies turn up, and you get little prizes for opening up the supply crates and get lots of goodies. Um, you get a new car, new vehicle. Also, 30 minutes of new music. But I haven't really generally explained what this game is about. It's a zombie survival game based around a single player experience. It's not other people coming, it's no co-op, it's just you as a player playing this game. Um, but I guess the main theme of this game is trying to keep your characters alive. Once your character dies in the game, that character is dead. Game over. <laughs> Which is quite uh, quite dramatic. I had one character, I think, in my, my 360 playthrough. I will link it in stuff in the description. Um, he was just a badass. He leveled up like loads, got loads of skills and stuff. And he was just like the constant character I had throughout the whole game. Just destroying zombies like crazy. But if he died... I would have been absolutely screwed because I put so much effort in this guy to like level him up and make him ultra strong and stuff. Um, but yeah, that's the theme you can go with. Once the character dies, he is out, he or she is out, that's out. Um, but you do have a community of people, so you're trying to get the community alive. You have to go and get food, you have to get ammo, you have to get like wooden stuff so you can sort of expand your base, uh, have like watchtowers, beds to sleep in, uh, medical sensors. It's a really, it's a really cool game, a very interesting little game to play. I really enjoyed my time with it, but it did get slowly a little bit boring towards the end. I'm just being honest. It was, it felt really fun at first, but it slowly got a little bit, I guess, repetitive is the right word, um, as I kept playing. But I think perhaps with some more like, DLC and stuff, some more guns, some new characters, I think I could jump into this game again and perhaps play more of it, which is quite exciting. Um, this game is definitely good, definitely worth checking out. I um, hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. I might leave some more gameplay in the background if you want to see some more. And yeah, thank you for watching. Bye bye. Holy crap! <laughs> Nothing's ever easy, is it? I guess we're moving on, huh? It's for the best. We're not the only survivors around, you know. There's a few other groups scattered around the valley.
find a good place to settle down, I'll come and meet you there. Where the hell am I gonna carry this? expected the universe to shit on us. I better look around some more. I got nothing left. <clears throat> I got nothing left. 